Today I'm going to show you how to retarget mannequin animations to a Mixamo character and the other way around. So let's say I have a Mixamo character and I don't like the available jumping animations on Mixamo. I want to use the Manny's Jump animation instead. Back in the day this process was much more complicated but with the 5.4 update it's gotten much easier. Start by browsing to an animation. It can be any animation since we can change the settings later. Right click the animation and select retarget animation. The source is the skeleton that has the current animation and the target is the character we want to get the animation. So once we have selected the right skeletons the animations for the source will show up. You can also search for an animation. Double click to preview the animation. So if you're lucky the animation will look just fine. If not it will be because of your character and its rig. Press export animation and select the location. Leave the settings as they are and press export. Now when we open the animation it will look a bit weird. This is because the Mixamo and the mannequin skeleton have different root and hip bones. To fix this scroll down in the asset detail section and disable the force root lock option. Now the character is not forced to be in place and the animation looks solid. It works great. But what if I try the running animation? You'll see that it looks fine in the preview and you would think that it'll work. Now if I disable root lock however we will deal with another issue. The animation won't be in place. Since Unreal is using animations that are moving and locking them in place using the force root lock option it backfires when trying to retarget to a Mixamo rig. I managed to retarget everything else pretty fine but depending on your character everything may not work. Now what if we want to do the opposite? Retarget Mixamo animations to the Unreal mannequin. If you're lucky it should work just fine. And you don't even have to change the root lock option. 